Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back once again to another Raw Deal Post Commentary video. Oh, I hope you all are having a wonderful day. I just wanted to ask these seven other people out there who are still enjoying PvP in this current form, why auto rifles? That's what you settled on as the new meta, huh? <laughs> what a joke. Like I said in my last video, the path of least resistance, first chance you get. I'm still devouring light and ending streaks before they can begin like any other Guardian of Legend, but it's no more satisfying than previous iterations of Destiny 2 PvP. As I previously predicted, not much has changed for myself as I've been a primary weapon enjoyer since the beginning, but the one thing I notice is how often I am able to survive situations where I normally would have died in the previous sandbox. Now that my opponents are being asked to aim with more accuracy, there's more room for evasive maneuvers and counterplay mid gunfight. It's a shame that the matchmaking is still subpar. If you haven't watched my previous commentary, you should probably pause here and do so before advancing any further. Doing so may answer some of your questions faster than waiting for my response in the comment section. I just want to know, who asked for this version of PvP, and who's happy with it? I'm going to say this again, this game is cooked. And just look at what they chose to put their effort into, and assuming the newest batch of content on the way is being developed with the best of intentions, I have to ask, what type of player do they expect to be happy with what they are offering? Free or not, that Into the Light reveal stream did not fill me with confidence for Destiny 2's future. Whether I play Control or Supremacy for Guardian games, the matchmaking feels awful. It doesn't feel any better than it did in any other previous seasons. Matchmaking also seems to be taking way too long now, and games don't always start with full fire teams. Something is either wrong with the matchmaking or the population has declined drastically. Could it be? Has everyone finally decided that they've had enough and are there really only seven other people playing control in my area? <laughs> I don't know, dude. The best thing about this update may be the additional controller dead zone modifiers. It might even be worth it for some of you to update your controller sensitivity settings. I reduce the size of my dead zones to help take better advantage of my reaction speed. I'm not done tuning, but I'm enjoying the increased precision so far. I wish I had more to talk about regarding PvP besides the auto rifle meta that seems to have arisen and the uh, controller sensitivity modifiers, but but I honestly have not been able to play much this week and once again is because of how poor the matchmaking experience currently is. Feels like I spend more time floating in orbit searching for a match than actually playing a game. Not a good look. But let me ask, let me, let me hear from you guys. How has the new Crucible been treating you? Most players I know in possession of primary gun skill are eating pretty good right now, but the Crucible experience still leaves us unsatisfied. If only PvP had an actual end game. How many of you would like to go ahead and tell a lie right now? Tell me that you enjoy playing Trials. None of the gear in Trials is strong enough to warrant my farming a playlist that intentionally handicaps me during matchmaking. I really wish Bungie would show us how they rate player skill and what the actual PvP matchmaking parameters are. Far too many of these matches don't even start out fair. And regardless of how well I individually perform, I can't imagine my teammates enjoy constantly respawning versus enemies they can barely outgun as the two versus one. It doesn't even feel like they are trying sometimes, so why bother? Anyway, I'm about ready to go play something else. I might just hop back on Doom this weekend. Or maybe I'll pick up the new Final Fantasy game. Heard that's supposed to be pretty sick. I'm not a fan of the lengthy movie style presentations. But it could make for a fun stream. We'll see. Guess I'll wrap it up here. And if you made it this far in the video, let me know by leaving a comment stating your favorite primary. And maybe I'll feature it in my next build video. I'm still experimenting with some of my favorite loadouts, but some outside influence may yet yield positive results. Alright, well, I'll leave you to enjoy the rest of the gameplay. And I'll talk to you later. Peace.
Five minutes left. Keep it up. No excuses. Look at you, at what one guardian can do, with nothing but your ghost, your weapon, and your life. Shut them down. By a team that fights together, stays together. on and claim victory. One minute. You have this. Take the crest, and you took all the crests. That's why I like you. 